Fauci says institutional racism contributes to coronavirus impact in black communities. To view the full article, click the first link in the description below. Dr. Anthony Fauci, director of the National Institute of Allergy and Infectious Diseases, said Tuesday that institutional racism is a contributing factor to why black communities have suffered disproportionately during the coronavirus pandemic compared to white communities. Fauci, who is on the White House Coronavirus Task Force, also defended the Trump administration after the president was criticized for suggesting at a Tulsa rally that the government should reduce testing so the number of recorded cases would be lower. Fauci doesn't see NFL season happening unless league adopts NBA bubble plan when Rep. Bobby Rush, D.L., asked at a House Energy and Commerce Committee hearing if institutional racism was a factor in black communities being affected more than white communities, Fauci plainly said, yes. Obviously the African-American community has suffered from racism for a very, very long period of time, Fauci testified. And I cannot imagine that that has not contributed to the conditions that they find themselves in, economically and otherwise. So the answer, Congressman, is yes. Fauci also gave other reasons for why minority communities may face a disproportionate impact. One was a greater risk of infection from work. HBO Max developing outliers series that will focus on Dr. Anthony Fossa because of economic and other considerations, the jobs that the majority of them would find themselves in does not allow them to protect themselves by looking into a computer and doing telework, he said. And then we know, from a lot of experience now, that the situation regarding whether or not you have serious consequences hospitalizations, intubation, complications, and death relate very strongly to the prevalence and incidence of underlying comorbid conditions which are clearly disproportionately more expressed in the African-American population than in the rest of the population, and that particularly includes hypertension. To view the full article, click the first link in the description below.